looks like a Hoover, sounds like a Hoover, but it's actually my computer! <laughs> anyway guys, let's come with the show. Hey, it's your biggest fan here, Denner51, and if you don't know by now, I'm playing on the map launch, in case Black Ops isn't familiar to you. Uh, and I usually by say by now, you know, I'm playing with my cousins, I'm playing with Darth, I'm playing with Mez, I'm playing with James Randi. And in this case, I'm playing with James Randi, but unfortunately, he is on the other team. Yes, unfortunately for him. My team go completely ham on his team, you know, and this is going to be like a little spoiler, but we go 201 to 61. And it is completely, do complete domination. I think I get dogs like twice. And, you know, he basically, basically gets no kill streaks whatsoever, you know, I'm just dominating his whole team. So now we know who the better player is, right? <laughs> uh, so, you know, for my main topic, I did want to actually talk about Gay Pride. Uh, not just Gay Pride, actually, Gay Pride Parade. And, you know, before before anyone says anything, I do want to put out a disclaimer, you know, it's okay to be gay, homose homose homosexuals. <laughs> Have rights just like everyone else, you know. Um, uh, some people, you know, people say that gay pride parades are meant to celebrate and express who you are as a person, you know, and celebrate freedom in terms of choices, you know. In, the, in this case, it, uh, attraction to the same-sex person, you know, it's, it's fine. Um, but you know, from my point of view, I think that this is actually a bit different from you know what everyone else is saying, and I, I just want to say that uh, you know. Yeah, again, you know, I do want to say, I do want to stress to this, that it's uh, it's okay to be gay, you know. Again, the homosexuals have rights just like everyone else. I'm not, I'm not saying that they should be treated differently, but, you know, gay pride parades may seem it like that. Like, um, uh, basically, gay pride parades are a way of saying, we're celebrating for being different. Uh, and th it, this doesn't really help necessarily with the stereotypes you know and if anything you know it feeds the stereotypes and that's the last thing you want to do you know if you uh, want equality in the world uh, for example you know you don't you know I've seen it on TV you know there's uh, people uh, kind of guys dressed as girls girls dressed as guys uh, kind of holding hands walking down uh, c kind of guys act acting really feminine on TV and uh, it's something that you know and the way they talk to you, they're like oh stuff it you know uh, on TV and uh, again there's nothing wrong with anyone who kind of talks like that but you don't really want to feed kind of the stereotypes uh, of being gay at all and I know that this is kind of a controversial topic so there are people out there who will say something like oh uh, you know you're kind of offending me or, or you're kind of wrong about this you're wrong about that and that's the thing about controversial topics you know no one's really going to be right uh, if you're kind of stubborn about your opinion uh, I can't really change it but hopefully you know everything will be fine uh, and when you come across like kind of controversial topics you tend to hurt people you get the people that are really insensitive to others as feelings and then you get the really uh, sensitive people so there's no real border about you know <laughs> what's said about anything but anyway let's continue uh, homose homosexuals are free to express express themselves but please be normal about it you don't have to kind of go to the streets and overreact you know claiming that you're gay or anything like that you know I, do, I, I don't think it really helps with equality like throwing a parade that doesn't really show it. no that that still shows inequality in society today you know uh, <laughs> and if gay people they, you know I, I kind of say this I'm starting to say this a lot now if gay people want to be equal you know act equal you know, there isn't a parade for, you know, there isn't a parade for, like, kind of straight people or, or kind of bisexuals who kind of like uh, both sex th stuff, you know, stuff like that. And I feel like, well, you know, there shouldn't be a parade for that, you know, because there's nothing wrong with anything. But I do feel like, you know, the whole situation regarding uh, being kind of gay with, like, I know, like, loads of celebrities are gay and there are some that do take it over the top. And it may be entertaining on TV, but... You know, you don't really want to feed any kind of stereotypes in terms of kind of anything. Uh, and, you know, I think everyone's seen it on TV, you know, walking around kind of, you know, saying, oh, yeah, I'm gay, you know. <laughs> so there's a terrible accent, but, you know, kind of saying, I'm sorry to anyone that's offended, by the way. <laughs> but uh, it's, it's just kind of saying, well, you know, yeah, yeah, let's celebrate being different, you know, let's celebrate it. And then let's celebrate being unequal in society by making more events that are uh, that make us unequal in society. And I don't know. Uh, some people may, you know, again, you can say that it expresses, it helps express who people are and kind of brings people out uh, d to express who they are. Like Lady Gaga said, you know, you were born this way. But I do feel like, you know, if if you if you really if you really really want to be treated like an equal, you know, just act equal, be equal. 
and if being equal means that you're going to be the stereo, you know, if you're feeding the stereotype, then that's fine by me, you know, but <laughs> uh, don't expect it to, to be treated equal if you're kind of going to follow the stereotype of being kind of annoying, kind of gelling your hair back, no, not gelling your hair back, but like, um, just kind of overly happy sometimes, you know, uh, kind of act, kind of males acting feminine, just stuff like that, you know, uh, it's okay to do that, but, you know, if you've got to take it over the top, you know, I've seen some people take it over the top a couple of times, and, you know, I guess, <laughs> I don't know, if you just Google, like, the stereotype for, like, homosexuals, you'll kind of know what kind of the, kind of the annoying side is, and, <laughs> yeah, that's basically about it regarding that but you guys some of you guys may actually compare this to um kind of race and that's fine because i you know i don't mind talking about that at all but some stuff like uh kind of black history month you know uh some people may say well you know if it's uh regarding race like if black people about slavery days and uh and you know if black people had a parade about their freedom you know <laughs> that will, you know, everyone would, would listen and no one would complain. Well, you know, I gotta say, I would still complain regardless of um, this, these kind of things. Like, like, for example, Black History Month, I don't complain about that, but I do feel like uh, some people express it a bit too much. Like, I know it's to do with how, you know, slavery and, and, kind, of it, and kind of reminding people uh, regarding kind of the past events, you know, rem you know, I'm saying kind of don't, don't, don't fall under that root of being racist, you know, and stuff like Black History Month. And don't try and kind of uh, stereotype yourself as kind of being black or anything like that. And <laughs> I don't know what the stereotype of being black is, but, but you know, you guys probably know already as I'm talking. So it is just one of these things that, you know, you, you should just kind of look out for. For example, like, uh, I wouldn't complain about Black History Month again. <laughs> Because I feel like it's not like a gay parade, pride parade or anything like that. People aren't going on the streets kind of ce celebrating. And some people are. And, you know, yeah, I don't feel like that's right because it doesn't really show equality. I mean, you can celebrate uh, freedom of slavery, I guess. But, you know, don't go around acting like, oh, yeah, this is this is the only day that belongs to us. Or this is the only month that belongs to us. Because that, that doesn't create equality, you know. Uh, <laughs> And I don't know, some of you guys might disagree with what I'm saying, you know, and it's understandable to to disagree with what I'm saying. These are controversial topics, but I just feel like, you know, again, if you want, if you want to be equal, act equal. And if, if, if you acting normal, kind of, um, if you acting normal is feeding the stereotypes, then act, act like, you know, you're feeding the stereotypes. But anyway, guys, I got 31 to 2, and it's been your biggest fan here, Den 51. Bye. If you like the video, give it a like and a favorite, and if you click the top annotation, it'll take you to the previous video, which was exploring Minecraft episode 1, it's a really good si <laughs> episode, and if you click the bottom annotation, it'll take you to my previous video, which was O-Levels and it replacing GCSEs, and I found it really interesting to talk about. Anyway guys, bye.